Welcome back to this Friday morning. Main Street in Breckenridge, one of my favorite ski towns for sure. Uh, you see the ski slopes there on the top right-hand side of your screen. This is sponsored by Ramos Law. All right, sticking with the weather theme here, uh, we are celebrating our three-degree guarantee sponsored by WireNet Home Services. And, uh, you know, we sponsor a different local nonprofit every month. And so joining me today is Trent from WireNut. Morning. Morning. Were the holidays good? They were. Awesome. They were awesome. Quickly. And joining me from our, our organization that we are highlighting today is Sarah Carey. And she is with, uh, last month, of course, uh, it was the sanctuary. Tell me about you guys, where you are, and what you do. We are Eagle Wing um, Sanctuary and Refuge, and we are out in Yoder, Colorado. <coughs> Excuse me. And we rescue um, neglected and abused animals. Okay. Um, so we've got everything from horses to chickens, dogs, cats. We take them all in. And um, we're a sanctuary, so we do not adopt out. Okay. They stay with us f for the rest of their lives. Okay. And we care for them. and. Um, so and you, and you give them a happy home, right? Absolutely. Let them live their absolutely. life. Absolutely. How do you guys come to know about and rescue these animals? Uh, sometimes, well, most of the time, I guess we get contacted to, um, either by um, the sheriff or the humane society. Sometimes um, family members and stuff like that will okay. contact us to let us know that. Hey, these animals are in, in need. And so, so regardless of the means, you're going to take them? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Uh, tell me, what are some of your biggest needs that you guys have as we head into 2024 here? Our biggest need right now is hay. Okay. It Which is, is expensive. It's very expensive. Yeah. yeah. So, so that's our so, biggest So we're donating almost $1,400 to you this month. Yes. Is that what the money is going to go it, towards? It, every dime of it, yes. Oh, that's awesome. Yes. Well, we're that's happy. Hay, yeah. yeah. I mean... It will it, it, help out tremendously. It is expensive, as yeah. you said, yeah. uh, my in-laws yeah. ranch, so I know that. Um, Trent, let's let's head to you. Why? Yeah, I mean, this is like the fourth or fifth year that we're doing this here. Mm -hmm. I think um, we've donated more than fifty thousand dollars. Why is it so important to Wirenut to be involved in the community? Uh, just community involvement overall, and you just I'm just recycling your word at that point. But community involvement at, uh, overall it means that you know we want to make this community stronger and we want to help in any way. So we're not, you know, by doing this donation, as you know, we're not the ones going in doing the heavy lifting on this. We're doing our part, and then with our resources, making it to where you can do the heavy lifting. You're the one that's got to go buy the hay, help the animals with it, and all that. But all these great things, positive things that are happening, what is, what is the spread of your positivity of how you're helping? Right. You know, what what is the impact of that? And we'll probably never know. Right. Maybe it reminds me, we just got off of Christmas, and one of my favorites is uh, It's a Wonderful Life. Maybe it's that. Yeah, there, uh, there you go. It says a lot to me about what kind of people you are and what you're about at WireNut, that you guys, reg I mean, we have touched so many different parts of the community over the years as well, from yeah. animals to people that have been abused, people that have abused substances. Really, it runs the gamut, and like you said, a strong community makes for a great place to live. It does, yeah. And her passion for animals, we were talking about it briefly uh, the, with the time we had, but reminds me of my sister, uh, my younger sister. We used to drive down the road, and if there was a dead animal on the road, we'd have to distract her over here because she'd want mm. us to get out and go bury it. She yeah. had that much love for all these animals. And so, and you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, Sarah, tell us about if someone wants to, to maybe contact Eagle Wing, uh, maybe they want to financially help out to buy some hay, or maybe they want to see if they can donate some time or something. How can they do that? So you can, we have a Facebook page. It's Eagle Wing Sanctuary and Refuge. Um, you can make donations there. We all, um, on that page, we also have a PayPal and a Venmo. Perfect. Um, and then we also have Eagle Wing Sanctuary Refuge dot org is our website. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for being here today. Thank you. For uh, we want to make the formal check presentation right now. So <laughs> let's bring in Joey. Joey, come on in. Don't trip over the studio here. Joey's heart. Joey's a big, a big man. Uh, Joey is, just shows the heart that the people at Wire Not have. So, uh, Sarah, Trent, thanks for being here with us today. Joey, thanks for being here as well. If you would like to donate uh, to them or you would like to maybe nominate a local nonprofit for our next couple of months here on the Wire Not Home Services 3 Degree Guarantee, go to fox21news.com. We will be back with a look at the forecast. Speaking of weather, right after this. Thank <laughs> you.